Russ, uh, it's pretty quiet here now, but let's just cast our minds back to the weekend and what a performance in a lot of ways that mm. the boys put in, albeit in defeat. There was a lot of positives to take from it. Yeah, massively. We um, we really we really came up firing out of the blocks and um, it's all credit to the, the, us youngsters to, to really go out and put a performance like we did. Um, obviously, not the result we wanted, but I think we were, we were right in a lot of in a lot of areas um, but all credit to Bristol for for coming back the way they did and and winning it in the end but yeah. you've been here long enough now Russ to realize that if you're good enough you, you're old enough as well and youngsters mm. do get their chance and you're seeing it this season yourself that mm. you know the opportunities there you want to take it don't you yeah massively and I think that's what this season's about for me just to really really grab it by by two hands and and get after it um, every opportunity is a was, was a dream come true for me so um, yeah I'm really just cherishing every moment as it comes. I know we spoke a few months ago and at that time I said to you I felt you came back a different player especially after Covid it was almost not not that Covid affected you anyway mm. but you seem to have a different mindset and you, you were fiercely determined and you're just really carrying that on now. Yeah I think over lockdown um, I had a few things to work on I got a bit of feedback from the coaches the academy coaches on uh, some things I could change. Um, and over lockdown, I think it was just uh, that mental switch for me just to really just let go, I think. And um, this season, I've really just tried to implement the same as end of last season and, and really get after this season. And as a player, when you get to the start of a season and the coaches say, you're in from the outset, like you were, mm. it's not a bad place to be, is it? No, absolutely not. It's, it's where I want to be, so. Like I say, any opportunity that comes, um, I really want to just grab it with two hands. For all young players though, this Premiership Rugby Cup, we've seen it as a stepping stone for future mm. and building. Um, I still put you in that young group. It's an opportunity for you, isn't it, over these next few weeks? Yeah, massively. Um, last week and this week coming up is really just an opportunity for all of us youngsters to to really go out and show show what we're about in, in the next Chiefs jersey. and. Um, and I think last week uh, the youngsters really stepped up and, um, and obviously Witten as well, um, he stepped up and, and yeah, really proud of the performance the boys put out even despite the result um, and yeah, just looking forward to firing into Gloucester this weekend. Talking of Gloucester, we saw they were at full, well, near full strength last week and they put it mm. to Bath. Um, what are you expecting? I, I suppose it's difficult because you don't know what to expect from Gloucester. Yeah. Absolutely, and we don't know what the selection process will be like. So, this week has all been always just been about us, what we what we are here to do, um, and and we know we know what Gloucester's going to bring in the in the strength of their malls, um, and we're just we're just really focused on ourselves. The coaches have made it really easy for us this week, just to give us one one goal and just to really get after it as a team. I imagine when you did the review Monday, the breakdown mm. in terms of the last weekend's performance, there was a lot of positives. It was just tightening up a few of the loose ends, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. In, especially in the middle third when we lost the we lost the number, um, and just I think it's massive as rugby players to adapt, and and it was a perfect opportunity last weekend to to adapt. And although we may not have taken that opportunity, we we it's, it's a learning experience and. And I thought we, it was it's a good learning curve this, the last week that's gone.